Hello, my name is Neil Halfin, and I'm a professor of pediatrics, public health, and public policy at the Geffen School of Medicine, the Fielding School of Public Health, and the Luskin School of Public Affairs at UCLA, where I direct the Center for Healthier Children, Families, and Communities. I'm a guest editor for a supplement to pediatrics entitled Advancing Life Course Intervention Research. This is a collaborative effort from the members of the Life Course Intervention Research Network. The Life Course Health Development Model views health as a developmental capacity of individuals. Health development can be represented by trajectories affected over time by multiple risk and protective factors arrayed in a relational developmental ecosystem across child, family, community, and systems levels. Dynamic transactions between these environmental factors and a person's developing biological and behavioral capacities influence the course of these trajectories, especially during sensitive periods such as early childhood and adolescence. Despite tremendous potential for early intervention at multiple levels of this ecosystem to improve health for life, this potential has never been fully realized and fully explored. In fact, life course health development is a low priority for both healthcare and research funding. Through the life course intervention research network, we undertook a modified Delphi process to delineate the characteristics of life course interventions. These include collaborative interdisciplinary co-design with youth, family, and community representatives, the ability to, of interventions to support the emergence of developmental capabilities, a focus on optimizing health, and an emphasis on multi-level interventions designed to improve more than one aspect of the ecosystem in which children live, learn, play, and grow. We have built a guiding framework for researchers as they plan, design, implement, evaluate, trans and translate life course intervention research into practice. And we proposed a series of core competencies for researchers undertaking this work. The LCIRN is at the its beginning of what will be a, a very long process of changing the way we think about intervention research. Our proposals for new directions have been generated by a, a group largely comprising academics whose diversity does not fully reflect that of the U.S. population yet. Next steps will need to include an iterative vetting process by a wider group of diverse stakeholders across the U.S. We hope these articles will spark discussion and debate they are not conclusions, but represent work that will continue to evolve as life course intervention research establishes its place in an effort to improve health both in childhood and for life. Thanks very much.